Hi, welcome to this video. Today, it will be a different kind of unboxing because this does, didn't come in a box. Your tires are the only part of your vehicle that's in contact with the road. So the condition of your tires is key to your safety. You have to make sure that your tires have a minimum tire tread depth. So find out what the law uh, in your area says and learn how to check your tires there. You should have at least 1.6 millimeter or, ju or let's just run it up to 2 millimeters uh, as tire threads for your tires to be safe. So there are different ways you can check your tire thread to make sure you don't have worn tires and that they meet the legal minimum thread depth. The easiest way to check that, so you can use this kind of gauge which I bought from AliExpress. This cost less than four dollars actually and shipping was about two dollars and it's a very useful gadget you, which you can use to gauge the tire threads. So the problem that I faced is that on AliExpress stated that the battery should be LR44 but when I bought it, it turned out the depth of the battery too big for this device you should buy LR43 and not 44 which is which has a smaller depth than the LR44 and this will work if you put your hand on it but the compartment will not close unfortunately but let's just go and explain to you the parts of this gauge so this is the measuring putter which will give you a visual indication of the depth this is the battery storage this is to zero out the display this is to turn it off and on and this is to change the measuring unit from inches to millimeters you zero out the like this then you can measure the tire threads on the back just information about the range and the battery type which is 1.5 volts some factors that can increase the wear of your tires is driving style aggressive cornering braking and uh, will increase wear position the tires on the driven wheels will wear more quickly and even more so on front wheel drive cars as these handle the steering too the speed in which you drive your car the load that you put on your car tire pressure and whether the tires are aligned correctly or not so we'll go out to see a live demonstration of how to use this on a tire so how you use, use this gauge that you have it here for well you take the gauge like this and you press here until you stop and then you have the reading so it's 8.26 millimeter so this is a very good tire thread see you next time